hey there so in this tutorial we will be learning how to model your object in blender i'll i'll be teaching you some modeling techniques some basic modeling techniques which you can use it to model your object so let's get started so i'll open a new file okay so here we go so first i'll delete this box I'll add one plane, shift A, plane, scale it, and now I'll have to add one reference image. So for that, shift A, uh, image, reference. I'll uh, I'll give the image in the description, so you can download it from there. This image. So before loading the reference image, just make sure you untick this checkbox and then load the image. Now just select it, G, rotate it. Oh, sorry. Select the image, G, rotate it around the X axis and make sure it's 90 degree you can change it from here press uh, type 90 and it's 90 degree so let's view it from the front view now so this is perfect please now we'll start our modeling work shift a mesh will add a cylinder the image is too large just scale it down G S this much ok now select the cylinder G Z here ok and just scale the cylinder by pressing G S and Z This much is okay. And just make sure your cylinder is right at the center. Just take it a little less. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so we are done. We are good to go. Now just press Z and choose the wireframe mode. Now you can see through the object. Now we will go into the edit mode. So you can either go over here and choose the edit mode or the shortcut is by pressing tab. So now we are in the edit mode. Now we will start our modeling. So first just select this area. Control R, click on the screen, and bring it over here and scale it. Yeah. Again, Control R, click on the screen, bring it over here and scale it. Again, Control R. Yeah, and scale it. Control R. Click on the screen. Scale it. One last time, Control R here and scale it, and just let delete this remaining part. So 
so to delete this press control alt and click and select and now press control x so it's deleted so yeah it's not perfect but that's okay you can do it perfectly i'm just here to tell you how how we can use this modeling technique so okay we are good to go we got the glass we'll see it in the object mode now we don't want this reference image so we'll just hide it so now now we have the glass and now we have to make we don't want this upper surface upper face so just select go in the edit mode and select this option and then select the face text and then choose faces so it's gone now we'll just solidify this object go into the object mode smooth smoothen up this little bit so right click shade smooth now we'll add one modifier okay sorry go to this panel which is then add modifier then subdivision surface so now we got that curvy glass so we'll add one more modifier which is solidify so now we are done with the glass so you can see it this is the glass so now we will give this glass a glossy look so for that go into material then you can see a principled bsds so just click it and select glass bsds and it's done now we'll just give this plane a shade a color new base color We'll select it as red. So we are done now. We'll just render this for before rendering. I'll select cycles. Go to render properties and select cycles. And now render mode. now you can see a glass so this is how you can do modeling so it's not pretty accurate but you can take your own time and do it this to model your object so let's get started so i'll open a new file okay so here we go so first i'll delete this box I'll add one plane, shift A, plane, scale it, 